Welcome to Backstage Pass. I'm Tara and I'm joined by Velvet Sky. Hello. Hello. Thank you for joining us today. Thank you for having me. Well, you are no stranger to MCW. We've certainly had you here several times before. So welcome back. Thank you. It's been a while since I've been here. It has. It's just, it's so nice to be back here. There's some familiar faces. There's some new talent, like up and coming talent. I mean, it's just... This is such a wonderful place to be, so I'm happy to be back. Thank we you. are happy to have you. <laughs> so for our fans who maybe aren't um, <clears throat> as familiar, although they'd have to be living under a rock to not know who you are, but you, of course, are the former um, TNA Women's Knockout Women's Champion and Knockout's Tag Team Champion. Right. And now you're in the second phase of your career, let's say. So tell us a little bit about what you've been doing now. Okay, so um, I retired from in-ring action in 2016. Um, I just had felt my time in the ring was up. Mm -hmm. just, we have, as wrestlers, we have like a shelf life. Yeah. You just got to know like when enough is enough on your body. You got to listen to your body. And I felt pretty good in 2016, but I feel like, oh, I did all that I had set out to do. Mm -hmm. Um, but I knew I wanted to stay involved in the industry and kind of just like branch out or transition into like a different role, just not in the ring. <laughs> so, um, I, let's see. March of 2021, mm -hmm. um, totally unexpected, I get a call um, from the NWA, mm -hmm. and they had told me that Billy Corgan, and I worked with Billy Corgan in, in Impact, so right. he, was, he was there um, briefly before I left, <clears throat> but the NWA had told me that Billy specifically requested um, that I come in and do commentary. Oh. And I was like, wait, what? And you'd never done commentary, no. right? Okay. No, like I thought it was like super cool, like that, I mean, First of all, I was a huge and still am like Smashing Pumpkins fan uh -huh. like, growing up. And I'm like, wait, Billy Cor Billy Cor Billy Cor what? I'm like, but so um it wasn't Billy that called me. It was mm -hmm. actually it was Pat Kenny. And um he's like, Yeah, Billy wanted me to call you and um, you know, offer you this. We think you'd be great. And I was like so excited, but I was like at the same time, I'm like, not to doubt myself, but I'm like, I've never done you know yeah. anything but wrestling you know and I'm like I'm very I'm confident in my ability to like mm -hmm. you know transition to anywhere in the business but um Pat was just like you know he's like don't worry Val he's like we're never gonna set you up to fail you're gonna be great Joe and Tim are pros they'll guide mm -hmm. you right through so um I've been there now for uh, about a year and a half okay. and the the transition was it was actually smoother than I had anticipated yeah. like at first it was you know it was a little nerve-wracking because I didn't know a lot of the faces in the NWA. Right. Like, you know, there were a lot of familiar faces that I had come up with an impact and on the indies that mm -hmm. I knew their names, their moveset, you know. But there were like a whole roster of new faces that mm -hmm. now I had to learn their names, their moveset, their backstory. But like for me, it was pretty like it, it was like kind of like clockwork. Mm -hmm. You know, like once I got in the seat, Joe and Tim, they would guide me and I would chime in here and there. But now I feel like I don't know. I just feel like so much more comfortable than I was, you know, a year and a half ago. I still have a lot to learn, yeah. obviously, but um, it's like second nature to me with commentary. And I like, I love it. And I love that I'm able to still be involved in the wrestling industry. Well, that's definitely a different <clears throat> skill set yeah, for sure. I remember years ago, I broke my neck and I got oh. to do commentary while I was recovering. And it was like, oh, oh I did not know how to do it <laughs> at all. And I, so it is an acquired skill. As yeah. long, I feel like as long as you know, like the move sets, you know, right. you could just, you, you might not know somebody's name at first, but you can call moves as sure. you see them, you know, yeah. like, so that's kind of like what I was doing at first, just chiming in with like, oohs and ahs and oh, big <laughs> suplex. Oh my God. And then, like, after a while, like I said, it's just, like, second nature, yeah. you know? So I'm really happy with my role in the NWA. Well, congratulations, and good luck to that. that. Thank you. Now, you've been in the business for a long time. You had yeah. your debut, uh, what, 2002? Uh, in the industry itself? Yeah. Yeah, 2001. 2001, yeah. okay. And then um, I was on the independent scene from 2001 until 2007. God, man, I was just about to hang it up. <laughs> I really was. Um, it was really, you know, back then we didn't have social media. Yeah. We didn't have like, you know, YouTube, like there was, there was nothing like, nothing came easy back then, mm -hmm. you know? So I'm dating myself when I say this, I come from the era where, um, people would go to shows with 
camcorders. Yes. With VHS and po tapes. Polaroid cameras. Yeah, also worth it. <laughs> so anytime I would have a match, I would ask the promoter, I would be like, can you please mail me a tape mm -hmm. so that I can make copies and just send out these tapes to promoters yeah. up and down the East Coast so I could get books. And, you know, I, I had a pretty solid indie career. Um, mm -hmm. You know, I was booked a lot. Um, I up and down the East Coast and just different states and stuff in the United, in the United States. Um, but 2007 came around at the beginning of the year. And I was like, you know what? I'm like, I'm 26 years old. I left school to pursue a dream. But, like, maybe it just wasn't in the cards for yeah. me. So I actually went to real estate school. And I oh. didn't want to give up wrestling. I really mm -hmm. didn't. I was so sad. Um, I went to real estate school for about a week. Yeah. And um, after after a week of real estate school, I was sitting at the dinner table with my family and I got a call that night from Terry Taylor. Mm -hmm. And he's like, he's like, um, I wasn't felt at the time. He's like, Jamie. Um, and Terry and I were familiar mm -hmm. with each other. Um, he's like, we're starting a women's division here, the knockouts division. And your name um, has come up in you wow. know, high regards. And we would like to sign you to a contract. If you wow. And I'm like, oh, my God. Oh, my <laughs> God. Yes. Yes. I'm like, after all this time, right. just as I was hanging it up, you know, is was when the call came. Oh, so wow. it was like the, the 11th hour, if you will, you know. That's so, wonderful. Yeah. So never give up. <laughs> no. And so in your early part of the career, you actually, you did have a different name. You were Talia. Talia right? Madison. Yes. 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 And here, you probably don't remember this, but you and I worked. We actually we did for WEW. <gasps> That's right. <laughs> yes. Oh my gosh! I was definitely one of wrestling. Yes, I, I was. Remember. It was one of your first matches. It okay. had to have oh been. My God, so I was awful. No, I was too. Oh, <laughs> so it was funny. I was like, oh, this this week goes back so. I do remember long. now. I do remember. So Working for Dan at WEW, <laughs> you know they're doing like a a D -Wow reunion yeah. later this month. Yeah, I heard. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I'm, 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 yeah. yeah are, you, are you doing the reunion? <laughs> um, I don't. I don't. I don't know. I know I sure. was on the fence. As I'm well, not sure, so. but I mean, those lots were the of days. Good, <laughs> lots of good memories, <laughs> crazy memories at Women's Extreme Wrestling. To say that, no, but it was fun. Like, it was. We, we had a we had a blast. It, it was. was different. And like you said, you know, you got to work a whole lot, and um, you have been such an integral part to like the evolution of women's wrestling. Oh, like if you think you. about coming from those early two thousand shows that we yeah. did, oh I mean, God. they were. <laughs> I cringe when Epic. someone resurfaces same, them, and I'm like, oh no, that they, wasn't me. That was someone else lot of, with the same name. <laughs> seriously, like a lot of times, fans will like they'll tweet me like the links from mm -hmm. my time in yeah. Extreme, and I'm like, oh my God, I, I know, I, can I can't just... even acknowledge it, like. <laughs> I was just so awful. You know, but you're so young and just don't know what you're it doing. It was great, though, because it got lots of experience when the stakes were pretty low. Sure. You know, because yep. like you said, we didn't have the internet where all this stuff was shared immediately. Yeah. Like, you had to wait for a physical copy of yes, a VHS tape. So that helped not to put that out there yep. in, like, mainstream media very but much. But now it's out there because you can go on oh, YouTube and there it is. And I'm just, like, cringe. I'm I like, know. Oh. I I one time saw a whole bunch of the videos at um, Sun Coast Video, and I was on a date, and I went no back way. the next day, and I bought all the videos. So, so that nobody, nobody else can buy them. I literally crazy. have a box of WWE oh videos. Oh, my gosh. They're probably so. worth a pretty penny now. <laughs> I don't know. But Just see, you, you started there, and then you have really come through the yeah. whole industry and made oh, such God, a name yeah. for yourself. And Thank now you. you have this new role, and I just wanted to wish you, Thank you know, you. congratulations Thank and best you. of luck. I appreciate that. So. Thank you. It's really a good role for me to kind of just – not go out on, but you know, like I said, I just didn't. Yeah. Wanna, I didn't want to leave wrestling. It's in your blood. You know, I, how it I is. can't leave. I can't, can't leave. leave. I'll be here, <laughs> but I won't be out there exactly. again. So, so it's a, it's a nice refreshing. I get it. So thank you. Well, thank you. Well, thanks for joining us tonight, and thank you. Thank you, fans, for watching.